Do you get error CE300058 when you try to play a game or use an app on your PS4? If you do, you either have a problem that's easy to fix or a serious one that needs to be fixed by tinkering with the hardware. Most of the time, a bad disk player or a broken hard disk drive are to blame. For some, it could be a problem with the software or a broken game disk. In this video, we'll show you how to fix this error code on your PS4. By the way, please like and share our videos to help those who might have the same issue so that we can help them too. Once you're done, then let's begin. First, you need to make sure that your PS4 is running the most recent software update. This means that all games, apps, and software need to be updated. Next, avoid using mods. If the software on your PS4 has been changed, you should go back to the official version. Some users told us that this was a solution that worked for them. Next, clean the game disk. If the error message only appears when you put in one game disk, clean that game properly. You can get rid of dust, fingerprints, and dirt by wiping it down with a clean, soft cloth or a microfiber cloth. If your game disk is broken or has deep scratches, the PS4 might have trouble reading it. Use only discs that have been cleaned and are in good shape. Keep in mind that most of the time, your PS4 can still read discs that are scratched. But you should think about replacing the game that is giving you the error if the disc has a lot of scratches or cracks. Next, delete the game data. Another thing you can do is delete the game's data from your console. This is especially important if the problem is only with one game. It's possible that the game data has become corrupted, making the PS4 crash every time you try to load a save point. If you have to, try removing the game from the hard drive and putting it back on from scratch. This should help you figure out if it's just one game or if it's something else. If you save game data, like saved games, on an external hard drive, make sure to delete those as well before reinstalling the game. Next, rebuild PS4 database. If you keep getting the error, you can try to fix it by rebuilding the system database on your PS4. To rebuild the database, you have to switch to safe mode. You must do this if the error happens in more than one of your games or apps. To rebuild the database, turn off the PS4 completely. When the device is off, press and hold the power button. Release it after you've heard two beeps, one when you initially press and another about 7 seconds later. Once the PS4 boots into safe mode, connect a DualShock 4 controller to your PS4 with a USB cable and press the PS button. Select the option Rebuild Database. Wait for the process to complete then restart the PS4. Lastly, get a new hard drive. If you've already tried all of those things and nothing has helped, the problem is probably with your hard drive. It might be either the internal hard drive you normally use or the external hard drive you've added. What kind of setup you have will determine this. In any case, replacing the hard disk is your best bet for getting rid of this problem. That's it. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it if you can leave a like or comment, subscribe to our channel, or share this video to your friends. This can greatly help in making sure that Google's algorithm can find and recommend this video to others.